Hello! Today we are going to review the Unity UT203 Digital Clamp Meter. The clamp meter comes in a bag like this, with a carrying strap. In the bag, there is the clamp meter, the strap, the testing probes, and the user manual. Using a UNI-T UT203, you can measure direct and alternating current, voltage, resistance, frequency, and direct and alternating current intensity of up to 400 amps. Also, it has continuity test and diode test functions. Let's take a closer look at the meter. The device is quite compact. The maximum diameter of the conductor is 26 millimeters. The device has a high quality plastic casing. The front panel holds the basic controls, the display, and the terminals for connecting testing probes. The bottom side has an eye lug for the strap. The rear panel houses the battery compartment. Power is supplied by a 9 volt battery. Let's briefly talk about its functions. The device is turned on by a rotary switch. Using the select button, the device is set to the measurement mode, where you can choose to measure direct current and alternating current. Using the RAL button, you can manually toggle the measurement range because switching the range is done automatically. The same range switching procedure has been provided for the resistance measurement mode. In the continuity test and the diode test modes, you can toggle between these functions using the select button. In the frequency and duty cycle modes, you can toggle between these functions using the REL button. Here we have the current measurement mode. There are two measurement ranges available, 40 amps and 400 amps, and they are both selected manually. The select button allows you to choose the type of electrical current. The REL button corresponds to the relative measurement mode. This function is vital for direct current measurement. Also, there is a hold button for fixing measurement results. Now, we will demonstrate the measurement of an alternating current in a three-phase power line turning the rotary switch to the electrical current measurement mode and selecting the alternating current measurement option, I'll crimp the A phase and we get 47 amps. Then I'll press the hold button and record the result. Now I'll press the hold button again and crimp the second conductor. We then get 27 amps. Moving on to the third conductor, 46 amps. You can conduct the measurement at the 40 amp range. Now we are switching to alternating current. If you do this, you will get a beeper sound like that, and the display will show the OL message. The range was surpassed. Now let's measure a linear and a phase voltage. We'll connect the probes and set the device to voltage measurement mode, turning on the alternating current. First, the linear voltage is 403 volts, and the phase is 236 volts. The UNI-T UT203 is a perfect choice for amateurs and professionals due to the low price, plenty of functions, and good manufacturing quality.